Not so fun facts you'll regret learning. Part 29. Earthly in 2020, pilots in Los Angeles witnessed a man 5,000 feet in the air on a jetpack, but the only problem was jetpacks really can't fly that high and fast. So after this was seen, an investigation happened, and it turns out that it was just a Jack the Skeleton balloon in the sky that resembled a person from far away, so everybody was freaking out just over a balloon. Next, in 1992, a 79-year-old old woman purchased a McDonald's coffee, but when she was driving, she accidentally spilled it on her lap and suffered third degree burns. Well, she ended up stating that the coffee was abnormally hot, so she sued McDonald's and won $3 million. Now in 2009, a man in California took his life on his own balcony outside. Well, his neighbors didn't report it for days because they thought it was a Halloween decoration and he was just being festive. Moving on, in 2020, a man in Berlin walked around with 100 phones in a wagon to make it look like there were traffic jams around the city because he was moving in such a slow pace with all those phones. Oh, well, the man ended up being able to walk around freely and the traffic jams were created in other places so he didn't have to worry about other people. Okay, this is odd. There's an exclusive club in Antarctica called Club 300. To become a member, one has to warm themselves up in a 200 degree sauna and then run outside in the South Pole in negative 100 degree weather, so would you want to join? Now in 2015, the Hello Barbie doll came out. It used speech recognition and connected to Wi-Fi. When you pressed her belt buckle, Barbie saved everything what you were saying to a cloud so she could learn your likes and dislikes and incorporated it into future conversations. But it was discontinued in 2017 because hackers could use the doll and listen to what you were saying. Okay, the musical artist Ed Sheeran loves food, so when a fan surprised him with a piece of cake, he of course accepted it. However, when he took a bite into it, it was filled with clumps of the girl's hair. This is why you don't accept gifts from strangers. For years, there's been speculations going around on the internet that the Teletubbies is based on a true story about a kid's asylum in Bulgaria. Supposedly, the purple Teletubby was based off a boy named Toate who had to spend the nights outside because he was mischievous, and from this, his body turned purple. And the yellow one was based off someone named Lala who had a face deformity which made it look like she was always smiling. The green one was based off somebody named Donka who got extremely sick which caused her skin to turn green. The red one is based on somebody named Paulina who fell asleep close to a fireplace and accidentally caught on fire and passed away. I mean, if this is true, I will never see the Teletubbies the same again. Finally, according to a Japanese legend, if you have Senpaku eyes, meaning you have white below or above your iris, you have the chance of dying early. I mean, this is just a legend and a superstition, so it's not totally accurate, so don't freak out.